We'll tell you why. Good evening, I'm Vanessa Bolano. Kurt Sprang has the night off. We begin tonight with video that's become the talk of the town. It shows shocking conditions inside Orleans Parish Prison. The video was presented during testimony about a proposed consent decree to reform parish jails. Darian Trotter gives us this behind the scenes look. It plays like a gritty documentary film. Instead, it's amateur video that gives a candid look at conditions inside the now shuttered Orleans Parish House of Detention. They got a lockdown, you know what I'm saying? I'm talking about a little bit of cash, you know what I'm saying? You can, you can get what you want in here. The video, released in federal court as evidence supporting the need to reform the jail, Perhaps nothing screams serious security breach more than a loaded handgun that found its way behind prison walls. Portions of the year's old video shows inmates snorting cocaine, bragging about a stash of Vicodin and Percocet. I'm talking about. The video even shows an inmate drawing heroin into a syringe and shooting up. These camera hungry inmates wanted to be known they were in the Orleans Parish Prison. Orleans Parish Criminal Sheriff. Living in substandard conditions, calling out the man they say is responsible. Martin Gusman, he do nothing for us. This how we never so nasty. Exposed are molded, mildewed showers steps away from the food line. No gloves on. No, no, no net over here. That's how they want to feed us. Right by shower. Prison cells so crowded, inmates were literally tripping over one another, sleeping and eating on floors. This got 14 got 14 man said they got 14 in this man. That's cold blooded. Sleeping on the floor, getting bit by spiders and shit. Yet somehow these prisoners still manage to enjoy amenities you'd never expect within a cell block. Well, you know, we're getting it in. We get it in. All day. Because they greedy behind money. They love the money. They love the money. Pop that can over, man. Pop that can over. Man. Pop that can over. Man. Pop that can over. Yeah, I got and guess what? I got something. something. And that video was released today on what was day two of a week-long hearing on the consent decree. Ultimately, it will be up to a judge to decide if that prison reform is needed over the city's objections over cost. We will continue to follow this developing story for you. Right now, we're live outside the OPP. Darian Trotter, WGNO News. Vanessa? Incredible story, Darian. It looks like that video belongs on a movie set, not in reality. And Mayor Mitch Landrew released a statement saying the videotape is outrageous. He says the tape was hidden in a safe in the sheriff's office and only came to light when the city's legal team fought to uncover.